hello friends welcome back to online math so we're going to find out the value of this expression right here you're going to be solving that without the use of calculator so that you actually see the simple trick for you to actually solve this even without the use of calculator okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to set this stuff inside the bracket right here that is root 2 minus 1 to be equal to a variable let's say x okay then at this point i'm actually going to move one to the right hand side so that i'm going to be having root two is equal to x plus one okay then at this point i will take the square of both sides so that i can be able to remove this root uh, square root sign right here so this is actually going to give me two okay it's equal to to simplify this bracket i will use x to multiply itself first that is x squared okay and then two times x times one and that will be plus two x and then finally one multiplied by is which is equal to one okay so i'll move one to the left hand side so that i'm gonna be having two minus one which is equal to one and then i'll bring a two x to the left hand side so i'm gonna be having minus two x is equal to x squared so you can see here that uh, x squared is equal to uh, 1 minus 2x okay now that i've gotten x squared i'm going to actually move back to the question i have right here and then in place of this stuff root 2 minus 1 i'm actually going to be putting this x which we've set to be root 2 minus 1 so my question is not going to be changed to x raised to power 8 okay so that at this point i can actually simplify this to be x okay x power 2 and then of course i can split this 8 here as or 2 multiplied by 4 okay uh, then if that becomes the case i am actually going to push these two inside so i'm, I'm going to be having x squared and all raised to power 4 and then you can see here that i've got this s squared so i'm going to be able i'm, I'm going to go ahead to replace this s squared here with one minus two x okay so that if i do that what i'm going to be having is one minus two x okay all raised to power four next i will also simplify i will also split this power four right here so i can write this as one minus two x all raised to power two and then of course multiplied by another two okay so that of course if you say two times two it gives you four and then i want to simplify this one that is inside the bracket right here okay so using the same rule i used earlier on what to open this bracket i'm going to say one times one which is equal to one and then i'll use this two to multiply the two terms inside the bracket so i'm going to be having two times one times minus two x and that's going to be give us minus four x okay and then i will also use this uh, last term here to multiply itself so minus two x multiplied by minus two x will give you plus four x squared okay and then all of this is still raised to power two then of course we have an expression for x squared i'm going to replace that right there so i'm going to be having one minus four x plus four into one minus two x okay and all of these is raised to power two okay so next i'll proceed to open this bracket so i'm going to be having a bracket one minus four x plus four times one here is four and then of course four times minus 2x will give us minus 8x okay and all raised to power 2 uh, moving on simplifying this stuff inside the bracket 1 plus 4 here is 5 okay and then of course minus 4x minus 8x will give us minus 12x and all raised to power 2 okay now i can go ahead to also open this bracket 5 times 5 here is 25 okay 2 times 5 is 10 and then 10 times 12 is 120x okay and then i will also use this last term right here to multiply itself which is minus 12x multiplied by minus 12x and that will give us plus 144x squared 
okay then i can also proceed to uh, make this substitution right here so i'm going to be having 25 minus 1 20x plus 144 into 1 minus 2x okay so that we'll have that this is 25 minus 120x plus opening this bracket this is 144 okay and then minus this will give us 288x okay then of course i'm actually going to sum the one that contains x right there so 25 plus 144 will give me 169 and then minus 120x minus 228x will give me minus 408x okay so what i'm going to be having is 169 okay minus 408x okay so this is what i have at this point and then yours you remember that we actually set our x to be equal to root x root 2 minus 1 so in place of this x right i'm going to be replacing this so if i read that we are now having 169 minus 408 multiplied by root 2 minus 1 okay so that what i'm going to be having is 169 minus when you use this to multiply this i'm going to be having minus 408 root 2 okay and then of course this mod multiply this will give us plus okay uh four zero eight okay so this is uh, if you add this to this you're gonna be having 577 minus 408 root 2 okay so this is actually gonna be the answer and then of course if you compute this in your calculator you're actually gonna be seeing that this will be equal to uh, 8.666 multiplied by 10 raised to power minus 4 okay so this is actually going to be the final answer to this problem okay so let me have your thoughts in the comment section if you've understood this video if you've got any value in the video do not forget to subscribe to our channel like the video and then turn on the notification icon so that you will always get notified each time we release new content okay and of course i'm going to see you guys in my next video bye